As always, we start with goals. But wait, something's not quite right here. This game seems familiar. Yeah, this is not a game from this season. This is a game from last season, when we had that sensational win versus the Premier League team Southampton. Now, why are we watching an old Southampton game, you might ask? Other than that, of course, it was a glorious win. We, as a league... One team managed to beat a uh, managed to beat a uh, Premier League team. That that's huge. But the reason that we are watching this is to get a reminder that we have beaten Premier League teams before, because we are playing one in today's episode. And uh, this episode takes place ASAP after the last one. And uh, you ha you haven't missed anything. And today we are playing versus West Brown in the cup. And West Brown currently are struggling to survive in the Premiership. Which means, of course, our goal is to get promoted. I'm not sure if we're going to get there, but we are desperate to get to Premier League. And West Brom is currently a team that's just around relegation spot versus surviving. As you can tell, if they win a game, they could be up in like 16th place. But if they lose a game, they could be down to like 19th place. So it's really close here. And this could be a really true away from uh, for ourselves to measure our chances for next season if we manage to get promoted because of course if we get promoted we don't want to get relegated so we need to be a stronger team than west brown we need to be a better team we need to prove that we not only belong in the premier league but that we are a team that can actually survive in the premier league so this is a big one and just just a little fans to think southampton that we beat uh, last season look at this they're currently in fourth place Fighting for Premier, not Premier League spots, but Champions League spots. That's a biggie. But uh, enough talking, it's time to play some football. And uh, I kind of don't prioritize the, the cup. But I mean, whenever we play a, a Premier League team, we need to try to do something special here. We need to try to, we always want to prove ourselves. We, we need to prove that we belong higher up in the league system than we currently are. Because we are desperate to get there so Maybe like that? Nope, nobody cared about the fans. Guys, where the passion. When I talk about the fans, you should get fired up, you should be motivated, you should be excited. But I don't care. And we are playing them away. So this, this is, uh, this is oh, the rain pours down. But this is uh, an extra level of difficulty. Not only are we playing a team from a higher tier, we are playing them at their home ground. Uh, home ground. They have the home advantage. And here is the first highlight. And we see West Brom with the possession into the box. It's clear by what the more Flanagan picks it up. Maybe this could be a counter attack. Flanagan, he sets up Wilson. Wilson into the box. And he hit the post. That could have been a, sensa a sensational start of the game. But now we have the corner. Let me with the corner. Maybe this is not over. Maybe something else can happen here. Now it's clear by the defense. And now Flanagan picks it up again. Will he start another attack? Oh, now that's it. And uh, another highlight to start with West Brom possession, but it's back in our possession. Flanagan going all the way back to goalkeeper, which I'm fine with. They don't take unnecessary risks. Lovins, Joe Allen, McGuire, McGuire, Ovideo. Ovideo with a long, long cross for Watamore. It's an open net. It's Duncan Watamore, his second goal of the season. It's brilliant for him to step up. Now that we have Harry Wilson out with an injury and he steps up, takes his place and look, look at this one. From the left flank with a long, long cross all the way to the right flank-ish and what the more. We are leading away versus a premiership team. I am very excited, if you can't tell from my voice. Here we have Ovidio with a throw-in, McGuire, Ledbitter. Going for Flanagan, Flanagan into the box, Allen, Watamore, is Watamore is going for the second one, what a game Watamore is having, he's really taking the chance here when Harry Wilson is injured and he's trying to prove himself that he wants to give Harry Wilson a run for his money even when he's back in business, Watamore and we are two up away versus a Premier League team, this is glorious because I mean as I said we are trying to, to see like what, what, what to come in the, in, in the future. But now we see Townsend, Townsend with a free kick. And it's, I'm not sure what our goalkeeper was up to there. At least he's saved, but it looked very weird. Two minutes of extra time. But that's the halftime whistle. 
and it's been a good I mean we are playing away and everybody knows it's more difficult away but we want the guys to stay focused now so I'm going to be calm but I want to tell them you might be winning but I could still change if your performance levels drop don't let that happen and most of them agreed except Honeyman who looks stressed and Honeyman is not having a great game let's see can I talk to you individually to you because you are our captain we uh, expect something extra from you um since he looks stressed i think i'm going to say something positive maybe like that there's a lot more to come from you and i believe you got what it takes and he looks happy i guess uh, that was a decent team talk this uh i'm very pleased with the first half now but now we need to stay focused because i mean things can change for the blink of an eye in football and in football manager not much going on at all but all is just to say that we get on the highlight here is what more is he going for the hat trick he finds Hanneman for allen Led bitter and with a long ball to nobody, nobody at all. And now West Brom is coming with a counter attack, and this could be really, really bad news. But luckily, that's just outside. I think it's time for some subs here. So let's see who's having a bad day at work. Nothing too terrible. So I think we're going to focus on fitness levels instead. But we can't sub what the more. No, no, even though this is six to sixty-eight percent fitness at eight point eight rating, the two goals. We're going to keep him on, but maybe we could go with Hanneman instead. He's not having that great of a game. Let's bring in Kurt, and we could change Kurt around with Maguire, because I think Maguire can play decently in the middle. Yes, he can, and then Kurt, of course, is uh, a decent winger. A pretty good winger, actually. He's young, he's talent. I have a big, expecta big expectations for him in the future. Ledbetter haven't been great. I think we're going to bring in Onion. And that means we're going to change him around because he will be a uh, box to... No, actually, we can keep him like this. We, we, could, we could do that. Nothing at all happens, so let's go for the last sub then. And no, what more you stay on, no matter what. We are going to go with who? Who will it be? Who will get the honor to be benched? I think we could actually go with Wilson. He haven't had a great game. So uh, let's bring in White. I mean, White scored in the last game and he haven't played much, but that goal he did in the last game was uh, a very important one. So I think he deserved to get some more match time. 10 minutes left to go and we are heading for a sensational result, but we need to stay focused because um, I don't take anything for granted. And as I say that, we see West Brom with a throw in. It's Harper. But intervened by Onien. Onien by himself. By himself, he sets up Wyke, and here's Wyke into the box, and nothing at all happens, but maybe, maybe it's not over, you well, it is over. Four minutes of extra time, I'm excited, I'm happy, this is a great result, we see Flanagan with a throw in, clear by the defense, Maguire, Flanagan, and that's the full-time whistle. Once again in this save, we have beaten a premiership side and show that we belong higher up into the league system. I'm going to go passionate. I'm going to tell them. Now let's see what I am I actually going to tell them. I'm going to say like this. I'm proud of your performance out there. Nobody gave us a chance today. Well done. Then I want to speak especially to you, Whatmore. The player of the match, the two goals, the one... Um, the one assist and the 9.1 rating. I want to talk especially to you, my friend. And uh, I'm going to, not with Kurt, that was a misclick. And I'm going to, uh, let's see. I'm going to be uh, calm. Already been passionate. I'm going to tell them I'm very happy with your performance tonight. That's a glorious result. That's, I'm happy, I'm proud, I am excited. And yeah, as I said, we have officially once again beaten the Premiership side. It's it's some really good news for for the future. Let's take a look at the schedule. Do we know who we get in the next round? No, we're going to have to wait for the draw. But that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching. Definitely press the like button. Whenever we beat the Premiership side, it deserves a thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next episode.